The information in this broadcast is for professional purposes only and is not intended to include or constitute personal mental health advice. You should obtain independent advice via your psychotherapist, GP or counsellor should you be seeking therapy for personal matters. For more information, please visit psychwebinars.com. So, <clears throat> I teach uh, all my clients what's known as the light switch uh, hypnosis technique. I didn't invent it. I'm not exactly sure who uh, originally invented it. I learned it from Jerry Kine, who uh, used to be of Omni Hypnosis. And down there, uh, you'll see my uh, link to my website, hypnosishealthinfo.com, backslash self-hypnosis, backslash self-hypnosis. And everything that I'm telling you here is there in written instruction, audio instruction, as well as video instruction. And if you just go to hypnosishealthinfo.com, look up in the orange menu bar, you'll see the word self-hypnosis. The first drop-down tab is light switch. And um, I just muted myself again. I'm going to turn on my camera here for a moment. Okay, and I always tell people just raise their index finger uh, and not literally like I'm doing it, but just have their hand resting you know, like on their lap or on the arm of a chair and uh, to raise their index finger and that is the light switch. Now the reality is they could just squeeze their fist, they could you know, raise their whole hand, they could um, tap their foot, I suppose they could even slap themselves, but we want some sort of physical cue and anchor that it's time to relax. When you do that, you can imagine an endless staircase or escalator or elevator of relaxation. Or perhaps a rope unbraiding. Or a pebble drifting down through the water. You want to go to your most relaxing place. Perhaps, well, I'll just, uh, what I'll do is I'll just tell you my relaxing place. I go to Paipu Beach on Maui. I can, I can feel the, the straw mat under my back, the heat of the sand coming up through the mat, the heat of the sun in my body. I hear the cardinals in the bushes behind me, those, those coconut leaves rustling. I hear the waves coming in, and there's, there's that, that sweet scent of, of plumeria mixed with the salt air, and I'm gone. Now, I encourage people to learn to do that in a minute, to take themselves into that relaxing place and just boom, be there. And the reason for a minute is that if I told you you're going to have to listen to Orange Blossom, for instance, every day um, for the rest of your life, you wouldn't do that. It's 27 minutes in length. It's hard to get that much time in. But every day, you always have the opportunity uh, to take one minute. You want to learn to do this uh, uh, five times a day. You need to anchor it to other activities that you're doing. Things like uh, well, either just before or just after you brush your teeth, uh, breakfast, mid-morning snack, lunch, afternoon snack, uh, dinner, teeth brushing at night, bedtime are all great hooks and great anchors. And, and you want to do it throughout the day because, well, hey, you know, if you can get to go to, to Maui five times a day, every day, go to the beach or your mountain meadow, your happy place, wherever it is, why wouldn't you want to do that? And, and of course, once you learn to do it in a minute, then you have the luxury of three minutes or ten minutes. Absolutely fantastic. Go, go for it. But, uh, you know, if you've had a number of, of uh, clients back to back and, and there's been a lot of... Um, pretty challenging issues, a lot of people that are hurting, uh, and your next client's already waiting for you, it sure is nice to be able to take a minute and go to Maui to the beach and relax and breathe and regroup and ready to meet your next client with a smile on your, on your face. The final thing on here is reminders. Um, you want to put up uh, uh, reminders, otherwise you'll forget about doing this. Uh, back years ago when I learned to do this, I had uh, sticky notes in my Franklin planner for two full years 
before I was doing it without reminder, and I would just move them from one day to the next day. Uh, today, uh, I put it in my smartphone uh, as um, uh, uh, I use an app called um, RX Mind Me. There's lots of different apps that, that work, or you could actually just do it in, in your calendar as a repeat appointment, just reminding you to do your self hypnosis. Thank <laughs> you.